Well, good afternoon. Um, I'm Becky DeWall, and this is Devon, my friend. He's here, and Annie's on the camera today. We're having some fun on a Saturday. We're prepping food for the week because you work. I work. And um, I have a busy week, so we're going to get everything done. Right here I have some portobello mushrooms. They're the big ones. I found them at Walmart. I had to go to a couple places to find the big ones. I brushed them with a little olive oil, cleaned them, and put them under the boiler for about four or five minutes. They got a little brown. I maybe cut that down the next time I got busy talking to Annie about it. So my mushrooms are going to get stuffed with taco meat. So uh, these are going to be taco stuffed portobello mushrooms. And one of them is going to be a serving. We're going to pile it high. So right now, Devon, do you want to go ahead and put the... We've got a clove of garlic okay. and a fourth a cup of onion. Or I'm sorry, it's two tablespoons of onion are going to go into that meat. It looks... It smells so good. And, oh, Devon, I forgot to get this out. Okay. No, I didn't. We're somewhere we have some peppers. And this, this is uh, hot peppers. Uh, yeah. Poblano peppers. Spicy, like, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, okay. Like do, okay. Spicy. So those go in. We're gonna chop it up a little. So you want to mix that up a little. Yeah. And I'll get some of the other things ready to go. This recipe has a can of organic diced tomatoes in it. As soon as he finishes browning that up, I'm going to put a teaspoon of parsley flakes. I'm sorry, I take that back. A fourth of a teaspoon of dried parsley. I have cumin, and we're going to have a half a teaspoon of cumin and a whole teaspoon of chili in there. So a lot of good things, and a fourth a teaspoon of salt and a fourth a teaspoon of pepper. So I'm going to start adding our ingredients. I think he's getting close. It's, it's, does it doesn't smell good? Oh my God, yeah. yeah? Okay, well, we can eat when we're done. So I'm going to go ahead and dump these tomatoes in. We keep cooking there yeah. and mixing. And in goes our fourth a teaspoon like of really that. It probably will be. Yeah, okay. yeah, well, ta in tacos, you yeah. know, a teaspoon of chili. Kind of a fourth a teaspoon of salt and a fourth a teaspoon of pepper. Because I'm on a health plan and we try to really watch the ingredients we add and try to really keep the salt down. And I have a teaspoon of chili powder that's going to go in there too because this is a Mexican flavored recipe. So that's cooking away and as soon as it's done we'll be stuffing the peppers with it and putting some cheese on it. I have four ounces of cheese there that's going to go on in it. Okay? Alright, well we're back. We're still working on our portobello mushrooms stuffed and made into taco mushrooms. It's going to really, it just smells wonderful. It smells it? so good. Yeah. I, I feel like before we store it, I need to try to feel it if that's okay. Yeah, <laughs> you, you probably should have it a take. Okay. There's a clean spoon that's yes. all your okay. own. Don't burn it's your tongue. Guys, it's like smells so good. And like she put like the peppers, onions, garlic. So I just want to try it. That's what oh, I do at back looks, home. That so looks hot. I will let you guys know. I don't care. <laughs> Good? Good? Mm. Okay. So good. Oh, good. <laughs> All right, so we're going to stuff these. And uh, the, I'm going to divide this meat mm. between the four mushrooms. And so good, like, I think it's going to be you, a lot. And you, these were big mushrooms. I wasn't sure. Yeah. Look, does that look it's pretty? Like, yeah, it's feeling it's so lean. Like, you know, it's just like really fresh. Um, it's light. It's, yeah. It's light, but it's, it's, it's like feeling like it's like comfort through. And this, you know. yeah, and this was extra lean beef, so we didn't even need to drain it. There wasn't any fat yeah. that came off it at all yeah. because this meat, and it even says in the recipe, if you have a little extra, you can just put it on the plate next to the mushroom. So, Devon, let's plate one okay. up for you to try, yeah, even though, you know, it's a little early for dinner, but I think that, you know what? I think Give you might enjoy, you know what we need to put on top, oh, of course? Cheese. cheese. I have four okay. ounces of cheese here, so I'll divide that between the four. Oh Does it look good? Yes. I think that's about a fourth of the cheese. And then I'm going to spoon that up. Oh, boy. Yep, it's a 
big one. Okay, yes. All right. Oh, and I'm going to give you just a little bit Ooh. extra Devon on the side Thank there. Thank you. Thank you. So that's a full lean and green meal there because your mushroom and the things that are in it gives you your uh, green and, uh, of course, the lean meat. So I hope you'll try this recipe. It's really a good one. And I think it's one that the whole family could enjoy. Thanks. I want to enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at the finished stuffed mushroom. It was taco, it was delicious, and I hope you'll try this recipe. Come back next week, I'll be sharing another healthy recipe.